Hi guys, it's me, and it's beta day seven. I had to look at my calendar real quick. I'm not so good with days when I'm a stay-at-home mom. They all kind of jumble together. Um, today's topic was, what is your hobby? I don't know, I'm one of those people who picks up new hobbies like every year, <laughs> but there are some that have stuck with me, um, tried and true, and I've continued to do um, when I have free time. So one of them, the first one, most of you probably already know, and if you don't, then you might just not know because you haven't watched me that long, but um, I blog. This is my site right here. Um, I've been doing it for, it'll be two years. It'll be two years. I used to blog in high school. I love writing. I've always wanted to write children's books. <laughs> that was what I actually went to school for. I majored in English and I wanted to, I wanted to write for a living. So, um, I don't know if I, I just, I just love writing. So that is a hobby for me because I don't get paid to write. Um, I would also say YouTube videos doing this is a hobby for me because I'm not monetized. I don't get paid for that either. Um, I just like to do it for fun. I like to do it for, um, the community. I like to meet new people. I really, honestly, I do, the only reasons why I do my Facebook or social networks or any of that is just so that I can interact with you guys. Like, I know it sounds really lame and people are like, okay, Kelly, yeah, right. You're doing it for something. But honestly, that's just, that's it. I've that's it. <laughs> I like, I like you guys. That's, that's it. So, um, the next thing that I do for a hobby would be downstairs. I'll show you. Um, okay. So this right here is my craft table. Um, I know it doesn't look like that, but when that is unlocked, this whole door swings open and then that panel right here goes up and that holds it up, if that makes any sense. So then it becomes twice as long. Um, I keep it in here. It hasn't really been used much because... Hold on, I'm going to set you down. Um, it hasn't been used much because I've had kids and stuff, so I had to lock it away, away from Wyatt. So, um, there's my fabric. I like to sew. Um, I like to quilt to be, um, to, yeah. Um, so that slides open, like I said, and then that bar goes up, and then the whole thing extends. So there's my sewing machine. It's nothing special. But you guys might, if you followed me last year in VEDA, this was one of my goals was to finish this quilt. Um, I didn't obviously finish it. I am... My goal now is to finish it this month because I really would like to finish it. Um, but this is the quilt pieces for it, the fabric. They're a bunch of paisleys. It's going to be a really cool quilt. I've gotten it probably halfway completed. I'll show you a square um, of what it will look like when it's hopefully completed. Um, so here's some one of the squares. So it's just, I you'd have to see. Um, I'll show you guys it when I finish it. But that is what I, that is a hobby of mine. I like to, yeah, so I like to sew. Um, and then I also like to crochet this big blanket right here. I crocheted that last winter, or no, two winters ago. Because our house gets really cold and I just, it gave me something to do with some coffee and, and you know, YouTube or playing in the background. That's what I did. So, um, crocheting, quilting, YouTubing blogging and hanging out with my kids I guess would be my hobbies. Um, I used to make jewelry actually I still sometimes do if I can't find the right pair of earrings I'll make myself some earrings but I used to have an Etsy store and here's all of the remnants of my earrings all of those are full of beads but I used to have an Etsy store and I ended up closing it and I stopped making jewelry because I got too busy <laughs> like um orders were coming in too much I know people are like isn't that a good thing but I had just I started it when I was pregnant with Wyatt because it was the first time I had never worked in my life so um I was bored and then I didn't think it would pick up so quickly and I didn't know how overwhelming it would be to have a child in school and also a newborn at home so I ended up closing the store and I don't think I'll ever open it again because I don't know, maybe, I, I don't know what will happen, but yeah, so I like to make jewelry as well, so that is it. I'm going to let you guys go because I believe I went over five minutes, but I guess I made up for that with my last beta blog, which, or vlog, which was like 42 seconds. Um, I did really quickly want to say a huge thank you to everybody. Um, I'm not going to talk about it too much since Ava's sitting over there and I don't want to start crying right now because I, that's how overwhelmed I am by all the messages, all the emails, all the comments that everybody's been, um sending my way all the personal stories that people have shared with me I mean I posted that video what yesterday or the day before that I can't remember um, and I've gotten like 87 comments on that video that I've read every single one of but it's hard to respond back to every single one of I've gotten 32 emails I've gotten 12 Facebook messages I've gotten comments over there as well and it just means the world to me to know um, 
just to know that you guys are there. I don't know why it does, but it does. So thank you so much. I can't individually write back to all of you else. It would take forever. Um, but this is my thank you to all of you. I really, I really, really appreciate it. So, um, and thanks for not making fun of my ugly crying face. I'm not an attractive, I'm not an attractive crier at all. Like I could never be an actress in like a romantic comedy because I would just turn everybody away because I'd be that like, Whoa! like, well, you saw it. it's not everywhere. My so face, so my uh, camera cut me off because I don't have enough memory on my phone because I have that many pictures saved away. So um, yeah, what I was saying was basically I'm an ugly crier, long story short. Um, so thank you for not making fun of me. Once again, I'm going to let you guys go. I will see you tomorrow for Veda Day number eight and... Yeah, I appreciate you all, so bye.